What's going on guys, welcome back to a brand new video today. I wanted to show you guys something that was very important to me. Uh, that I mean, I've been using Premiere Pro, this Adobe program, since I was uh, in grade six, so that's about five years ago. Uh, so I do have quite a bit of experience with it. I'm definitely not the greatest in the world. I don't know, I can't make, you know, any of those big projects that some people on YouTube make. Uh, but I can try my best to show you guys some things. And today I wanna to show you guys how to make transparent text over a video file. So right here, I'll just drag into the timeline. We've got a, um, what is this, a, a time lapse here I made in uh, Flinders Street Station. Uh, you can see there, it's a pretty popular tourist destination in Melbourne. Um, I don't live in Melbourne, I live near, I live near Melbourne, but um, it was something I happened to do on the day. So I'm just gonna use this real quick. And uh, you can see we've got this on video layer one. I'll just quickly make a text over the top of it. It doesn't really matter what it says, you can put whatever you want. Um, a lot of people use this tactic, uh, use the, uh, you know, this style in a lot of vlogs and stuff like that. We'll drag that to the middle. Um, we'll make sure we center that text roughly and we'll make sure up here in this effects uh, control tab up here, we'll go down to track mat key. We'll search track and we'll go to under video effects and under keying, we'll go to track mat key and we'll drag that onto our video layer. So not to the text layer, but the video layer. So we'll stretch that out and we'll make sure we click onto the video layer. We'll go up here to the track mat key uh, video effect setting. Under mat, we'll click on none and we'll go to video 2 which is where our text is so we'll click on video 2 you can see there it is uh, showing up behind it to make it, it kind of pop out a bit more we'll click back onto the text here and scroll down to scale we'll make sure we're at the start of the clip up here we'll click that little stopwatch there where it says toggle animation make sure it's on a hundred and we'll drag uh, about three quarters away through the clip and we'll zoom up just so the text takes up majority of the screen there we'll do about there uh, and as you can see here the text kind of crawls and scrolls rolls forward uh, under using that scale option so that's something there that uh, is pretty pretty cool I thought it was a pretty cool thing to do uh, now I mean you can use this in a lot of people using holiday videos you know you could probably use it in the intro possibly something like that I mean um, in, a, in a way maybe the Marvel intro I'm, I'm not sure if you guys know but the Marvel intro is something like this they kind of use a transparent text to show uh, videos underneath that so anyway guys uh, make sure you do leave a thumbs up for this I will do more premiere tutorials and I I will also continue with 2K. 2K really helps me to kind of express my knowledge of Premiere and I uh, will continue. I'm going to currently learning After Effects, so that's something I want to continue to learn. Uh, but anyway, guys, if you did enjoy and you did learn something, please tell me down below and I'll see you all next time. Peace.